Good morning everyone, welcome at a brand new video here on YouTube. My name is Mad Max and today I'm gonna show you some brand new stuff that I found on the internet. First of all some stuff for myself. 16 gigabyte USB stick for 4 euros. A brand new DVD writer for 14 bucks. A pretty nice Final Fantasy X strategy guide for 8 or 9 euros and that's pretty cheap because the Final Fantasy guides are rising in price at the moment. Then one of the better comedy series from back in the days, <coughs> the first season of Full House. I uh, watched this a lot uh, when I was younger. I found this for 4 bucks from Belgium and that's pretty cheap because these DVDs are going for like 20 to 25 euros per season. Then some stuff that I found on ebay.uk that's Boulder Ga Boulder's Gate Dark Alliance 1 and Boulder's Gate Dark Alliance Part 2. Both of them together for 7 bucks. Uh, part 1 is a double one but uh, it's pretty nice that I found both of them for a pretty good price. <coughs> then one of the best RPGs on the PC that I didn't have. Um, I played it for like one hour or so and definitely gonna play it more and that is The Witcher Enhanced Edition. Uh, the Witcher is a uh, Polish, Polish game made by CD Projekt and powered by Bioware and Renderware. Um, it's one of the better RPGs from the last two years. Uh, part 2 is maybe even better and part 3 is gonna be a one hell of a sick game uh, on the PC and on the next gen consoles maybe. The Witcher is a fantastic RPG, uh, if you like RPGs play this one because it's a fantastic game. Paid 14 euros for it, new, in a, in a store here in the Netherlands. Then a game, I was not so happy about it. Um, this game was posted on eBay and it is a pretty rare game on the PlayStation 2. The thing is it's a collector's edition, but uh, in the photo uh, I saw that it was uh, brand spanking new etc. And in the description uh, the seller uh, told me that the box was a little worn etc. And a little bit scratchy, but then it, it came to my house with, with the post and this is how it looks like. It's completely ripped off, fucked, etc. It's Mana, Kemia, Alchemist of All Rabbits. Uh, it's complete. With the, the game. And the soundtrack with a little poster. The soundtrack has uh, 33 tracks on it. Pretty good to find uh, this one for like 15 euros, but the thing is. I, I contact the seller, I said, look man, this is not the way I want my games uh, when I bought them from eBay. And he said, yeah, okay, um, I'm gonna pay you back, but send the, the game back. Of course I want to send the game back, but I'm not going to pay for the, for the sending, so that's bullshit. Uh, you send me the wrong stuff. Uh, if you pay also the sending, then I'm going to uh, send it back. If not, then not. Easy. So look out when you buy on eBay because this is fucked as hell. But okay, I have it and I'm gonna keep it till I found a better copy and that's gonna be very hard I guess because these games are pretty hard to find in the world. Then a game for my own collection and that's a game for the Nintendo 3DS. I found it for five bucks here in the Netherlands on a website and that is pretty cheap because uh, the cheapest uh, on the net was about 30 euros and that is Epic Mickey Power of Illusion. Played it a little bit, it's too easy, it's pretty kiddish, uh, but I love Mickey Mouse and I want to have this so now I have like oh, four games on the 3DS. As you can see here, Super Mario Bros, Resident Evil, Pilot Wings and Mickey, the reason why I don't have so much games for the 3DS is because they are pretty expensive. That's the reason. Uh, I'm not going to pay 30, 40 euros for a game. So I'm waiting till I found uh, some cheap ass games on the 3DS on flea markets, etc. Then I found again three copies of Epic Mickey, also on the same website, also for five bucks a piece. 
two sealed copies for the Wii and one for the PlayStation 3. The reason why I bought these is not because I'm a reseller, but I'm going to trade them to a game store here in the Netherlands. And I'm going to get 18 to 20 euros a piece back. Oh, there is my cat. 18 to 20 euros a piece back. Uh, with that money, I'm going to buy some stuff for my collection in that retro game store. Uh, like some uh, special games for the PlayStation 2 or or something else, I don't know yet. I'm going to trade them tomorrow or in two days, I'm not sure. Then for the last, for the last, I found s again some guides from the same guy uh, where I bought the guides from, uh, I think a month ago, I bought them for one cent a piece. And again, I paid like one cent a piece for his new strategy guides, SSX Tricky 3, Rich Razor 5 and MotoGP, and all these guides are in flawless condition. Return to Castle Wolfenstein, Kill Switch, 007, Enthusia, and this game looks a copy of uh, Gran Turismo. Uh, you have to train yourself, you have to uh, get licenses, etc. Never heard of this one, but it seems uh, to be a pretty good uh, racing simulation game on the PlayStation 2. Definitely gonna pick uh, this, this game up, Ethusia. Delta Force Black Hawk Dawn, Armor Core Nexus, and then the last one uh, I paid like uh, six bucks for it. The reason why I paid more for it is because it's a very popular game still and it's 100% uh, complete. It's the Shinobi strategy guide with the poster. I hope you can see it guys. And the poster is still in it. And a little strip of Shinobi inside the strategy guide. And that's pretty nice. Next to that he sent me also some free stuff. He sent it to me because uh, he liked my uh, quick payment and yeah, yeah, I'm a collector so he sent me some free stuff. The first thing is a Breath of Fire journal. Um, it's an official uh, merchandise thing from Breath of Fire and I'm going to give the, this thing away uh, when I have my 100 subscriber giveaway. It's just uh, a little book where you can write your stuff in or, or something else. Um, pretty funny to have for a collector. I'm not going to uh, collect this one, I'm going to give it away. He also sent me a pamphlet of Nano Breaker, Nan Nano Breaker and a strip of Medal of Honor European Assault. I didn't know there were strips of uh, the shooter from EA, but this is number zero, the special edition. Also going to give this strip away. <coughs> then a pamphlet of Shin Megami Tensei Devil Saga 2 and this one I'm keeping for my own collection and then the official Medal of Honor War Chest complete but this is the cardboard edition in the Netherlands we had the plastic case edition this one is for Noel uh, he's one of my subscribers uh, that sent uh, some games to me a couple of weeks ago uh, we did a trade and uh, this is for him because uh, he has some new stuff for me then, also free from the same guy, a Sony PlayStation Portable Media Manager. Uh, this one is complete and I'm going to give it away also. And then the special edition of Batman Begins on Blu-ray without the Blu-ray disc. And I'm also going to give this away. Also a little strip inside. And for the last thing, I want to tell you guys, when I reach 100 subscribers, I'm going to give away some amazing stuff. The PSP Media Manager, the strips, and also some free games. So watch it out. Um, the 100 subscribers uh, giveaway is going to be here in a couple of weeks. Uh, you can see it on eBay, and uh, I'm going to tell you what you have to do to uh, enter the contest. Pretty simple. Uh, leave a comment or something like that, and I will uh, pick one or two or three winners. And it's not European only. If you're from America or Australia or whatever, everyone can enter the contest where I give away some free PAL European games for the PlayStation 2 and maybe some stuff for the PlayStation 1. So guys, I want to say till next time, 
and I hope you liked the video and I want to say bye bye.